If you get hurt on the job, how long is workers' comp liable for that injury if it reoccurs? The reason I'm asking that is because I hurt myself in 2014, and I called the doctor because I was having some issues with my shoulder again, and they said I had to go through workers' comp, and workers' comp said that they are no longer liable for it. Their liability ended after two years, which was uh, December of 2016. So, Let me ask you a question. Did you close out your medicals, or are your medicals open? Uh, they said the case was closed, but I never received any notification of the case being closed, and I didn't uh, receive any medical compensation, which I wasn't looking for anyway, but my understanding is that you're, if you have a disability rating that you are uh, eligible for that, and they didn't receive any information about that either. And Dennis, let me talk about that. that's called a statute of limitations. And in Tennessee, there is a one year statute of limitations similar to personal injury. Unfortunately, what happens is, is it's one year from the date that any benefit is voluntarily provided by the insurance company. So let's say the insurance company pays for a doctor's visit on July 1 of 2016. If you don't seek treatment and you don't receive a settlement, as of July 1 of 2017, your right to get any benefits for that injury are gone, um, regardless of whether you continue to need treatment. Um, it's a very drastic situation, but unfortunately it happens to a lot of people. Now, if he would have uh, received a settlement off his impairment rating and they stopped the benefits, he would have a cause of action? Correct, Jason. Uh, in that situation, you would have a settlement with an open medical provision, and then if the insurance company says, we're not going to pay for your treatment, then you can seek help either on your own through the Department of Labor through a court or seek an attorney to help you with that.